Hey everybody, today we're taking stock of things. Hey David, is 120 film stock, the, the physical material of it, the same as 35 millimeter film stock, only larger? That's a good question. And to a point, I think that depends on the physical film. Some of the 120 film stocks use a different base, uh, a different plastic backing than the 35 millimeter cameras do. And that's because of the specification requirements set up for the film and how it's made, as well as some other technical reasons. The 35 millimeter films, even 35 millimeter films among themselves have different materials. So the short answer is that no, the plastic backing is not necessarily the same on 120 as it is on 35. I tried to find out if the emulsion is the same because certainly the development times tend to be the same between the two stocks. I wasn't able to find out conclusively. What I can say is that there is a, uh, a couple of specific Kodak black and white films that I use where on 120, during the pre-wash, the water comes out green, and on 35 millimeter, it comes out either clear or pink. So, the same water coming from the same tap. It, at minimum, it seems like the dyes used to sensitize the film might be different, but beyond that, I can't answer the question uh, as to if the emulsion chemistry between the different formats is the same or not. 